everyone, it is Rachel and Kelly from All Access Pass. And we are at the Vancouver Island Music Business Conference and it is great here, you guys. Honestly, you have to come next year. We're, this is their third year running and- There's so uh, much going on. It is, it is amazing, so educational, yep. so much information and if you're just starting out in your career or you've been doing it for a while, save yourself the money and get some of the advice from these fine, knowledgeable people. Yeah, you know what they're talking about? Oh, come on! Check out this edition, All Access Pass here. We're serving it up for you, just for you. <laughs> All of our thousands of closest friends. <laughs> um, I've been in, let's see, it's already, it's already a blur. Uh, I've been on two panels and one critique so far. Um, one of them was independent music and kind of how to make money out of it, which is um, not always the easiest thing yeah. to do. And what everybody's trying to do. Yeah. How to figure out how to do it. And it's a whole new world out there. It's, it's, it changes seemingly about every five years right now. Yeah. And, uh, and I moderated some songwriters today, which are all my, my peers and guys that I love. And I said, oh, that's a two note. And I said, what's a two note? She says, well, I says, if you were driving down the road in your car and that song was playing on the radio, you would have changed channels right now. And uh, the thing that took me years to absorb was what he was really saying was everybody would do that. Or most people would do that, you know? So now when people tell you there's no rules of songwriting, that flies right in the face of no rules. Because maybe you want to call them principles, whatever you want to call them, everybody responds to what's going on. When Draw from that stuff. I mean, obviously you were you were motivated. So uh, <laughs> draw from that that information. Well, you know, you make a, it's a really good question that you're asking, and I think it, there's a number of answers to it. But I think the the song has to have the clarity. You know, so many the time we as a listener we hear the songs, we don't know what they're about. We don't. You want you want a hit song, then this is why you're in Nashville, man. I, I don't want another call. We're there. It's exactly what you're saying. Don't yeah, bore us. Take us yeah, to but I think myself, you know what I mean? You just say, you know, this this hurt, or you know, you simplify it, and it gets the impact of the emotion out. Just just keep it simple. What you this song is an orphan because everything else goes away, and if that song doesn't function, doesn't invite me in, talk to me about me or a situation I heavily identify with, get me the first use of time in the 60 seconds, slam me past the two minute wall, deliver me at the end, and make me want to go. Man, that's great, I want to hear it again. Then you're, you're whistling in the wind. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, thank you for all for being here this morning. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. She spends the time to personalize them. So when you're, when you're receiving them, you engage, you get engaged. And it's very time consuming, but it's also very powerful. I don't do this fantasy land crowd. And I surround myself with people who are doers and not dreamers. So, that note, I'll close off and hand you over to Ron. Hi, everybody. My name's Ron Pruitt. I work in fantasy land. <laughs> I work in television. Right? And they're going to tell all their friends about how great they love this band. They're not videotaping you because they don't like you, right? So, I'd say. Go with it, if, you know, and just make sure you've got your stuff together and you're looking good and sounding good. Well, Ron, I don't know, but I thought you were fabulous on that panel. No, no, you were truly no, fabulous. I no, 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 you was the fabulous no. one.
Was that like the most amazing thing ever? I wanted to go out and buy that CD. I, I was actually I bought the book. I was motivated to do that. That's what people are doing. They're buying that experience, that moment, that thing. So that's why live is so important. As you have. And the same values. Yeah, absolutely. Very important. So if you're doing children's music, you don't want to line yourself the tobacco company. Not so much. <laughs> exactly. This is uh, the second year to do this conference. I uh, saw lots of great music. I ended up signing one song from a, an artist here from last year. Uh, I'm the acting general manager of Factor now. Yeah. I'm out here doing a Factor panel. And, you know, You've been in the business for how long? Uh, 25 years. Since you were five? This year, since I was five, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I so want to get in on no it. No human contact. <laughs> Thank like you. Aww. We all have this to start. So the Canadian industry is doing well. Alive and well. Awesome. Has a real heartbeat. Being right here. Now, are you sitting on any panels today? Today I am. On one called What's the Deal? And I did one on Friday, a producer's panel. Cool. So, and it's great. It's kind of like a mini CCMA in a way. You get to see everybody that you want to see. And yeah. On a beautiful setting and lots of information, huh? It's been great. And then we get to party later. Yay! Okay. <laughs> Today we are at the wrap-up party for the Vancouver Island Music Business Conference. Because the relationships that you make here yeah. may end up helping you down the road. If people see that you have tenacity in the business and they're here after year after year and they get to be in positions of power and they see that you're committed, yeah. there could be working relationships. Yeah. It was totally like that. <laughs> so now, now, um, are you gonna come back next year? Oh, is the sun going down? And <laughs> think it doesn't show, but I don't care. don't tell me what we're doing. Don't tell me. Don't ruin it. Just You know, things that help you along the way sometimes are hard to uh, plan. Yeah. You know, but. For sure, if you come to something like this, there's so many people doing the same thing you're doing. Yeah. It's been a good con. Yeah, it's all over Canada. Yeah. The caliber Nashville. of the panelists that come to this conference and the accessibility of those panelists is Everybody bar none unbelievable. Open minded, yeah. they all talk to you. It's, it's yeah. really cool. <laughs> Give my hand, Lord, kiss 